Ebony the Realtor. Welcome back to my channel. If you end up loving the vibes, make sure you hit that subscribe button and become a homie of mine. We are headed on our honeymoon. Say, baby. We um, are catching our flight to Miami and then Miami to St. Thomas. So, um, it is currently 4.28 a.m. I don't know if y'all can see that, but early AF. <coughs> and our flight leaves at 5.45, so we made it in time. I had us walking to the wrong terminal. My bad. Um, but yeah, we just waiting to board our flight. It boards at 5.10, so we got a good little minute before we board our plane. See y'all in Miami. We boarded our first plane off to Miami. Alright y'all, we have a layover in Miami. I think our flight don't take off to about 12, I think. Let me check. We depart at 12.15 and we land in St. Thomas at 2.59. So we have a good little while so we stopped at TGI Fridays in the Miami airport to eat. So we're gonna be chilling here for a while. Yeah, I'm excited. Say hello to the people. What's up, y'all? How y'all doing out there? Alright, gonna catch y'all later. sitting here for a little minute we board in 49 minutes um we had a little over four hour layover and then they end up changing our terminal while we were waiting at tgi fridays so we're waiting to board we've been chilling i've been watching some youtube videos and tiktoks and all of that stuff but <laughs> check me out check me out but, um, yeah, I'll let y'all see Terminal. Hey y'all, we have arrived in our room. We are at the Margaritaville Resort. If you had not seen before, this this room is amazing. We got upgraded. I ain't even know we got upgraded. Upgrade is okay. We'll take it. But I'm gonna give y'all a quick room tour. It's really nice in here. We done had two margaritas. They greet you with margaritas. Child, guess what I did? Your girl forgot to pack bathing suits. How in the H-E double hockey seats I forgot to pack bathing suits coming to an island. Now I got to find bathing suit or a couple of bathing suits. Cause how? But our first order of business is doing this room tour and then getting some food. Cause homegirl is hungry. But this is our room key. This is how we like 
Um, we got a backup room key, but this is how we get in and out our room and get like the different discounts around the resort and different restaurants in the area. So, mission number one is getting me a bathing suit so we can go to the beach um, sometime today or either tomorrow. But the first order of business is, like I said, doing this room tour and then getting us some food. So, y'all hold tight. He want the scoop, she want the tea. She want the tea. I cannot speak. We keep it in the street. We keep it in the street. I took a loss, but you still gonna get beat. You still gonna get beat. How much it costs? It never been cheap. It never been cheap. Turn your click up, dog. Turn them up. Turn your bitch up, dog. Turn them up. Turn these streets can't cross it. Cross them up. All these streets need bosses. Cross them up. Turn your click up, dog. Turn them up. Turn your bitch up, dog. Turn them up. Turn these streets can't cross it. Cross them up. All these streets need bosses. Get my dog get low in this pocket. I'm picking no more. We came from the bottom together, my nigga. We get it. We spitting it up. If my bitch tell me pay for that pussy, I'll take her ass shopping and tell her shut up. Standing on business, standing on bitches, ain't nothing to pipe that shit up. It ain't nothing to turn your bitch up. It ain't nothing to turn your click up. Ain't nothing. Shit. We turn the jeweler up, just look at the diamonds we bust. Look at the people we touch. Shit, I'm feeling like Puffy and Russ. I'm sending this shit like a toilet, little nigga so nasty, I've never been flush. Bulletproof rappers that came with a kid on it. The shit that you like, it can't keep you spit on it. The bands, I put a little shit on them. Dope in my hand, I had to go flip some. Let's go. He want the scoop, she want the tea. She want the tea. I cannot speak. We keep it in the street. We keep it in the street. I took a loss, but you still gonna get beat. You still gonna get beat. How much it costs? It never been cheap. Okay. Good morning, y'all. What time is it? It is 8:54. We been up for about maybe like two hours because we went to sleep real early last night because we both had five margaritas a piece. Well, technically like four margaritas. We took one back to the room with us and put it in the freezer and I've been sipping on it this morning. YOLO, okay. So I can't remember if I said that we're at the Margaritaville Resort in St. Thomas. I'm loving it. The view, amazing. Y'all saw it yesterday. Amazing. Like I could wake up to this like every day. Like I would be one of those people like when I got me some money, like we could definitely buy a vacation home and when you get to this time of year we you know go and stay at our vacation home i'm i'm with it babe's with it i'm with it too because when we get we, when we get us a real shiny coin okay we can go buy us a vacation home and october through december or maybe october through like february when it start back warm up we can go back home Cause we checked the weather back home, 47 degrees at seven o'clock this morning. Here it's 83 degrees. Who wouldn't? I would for sure. So um, the plan for today, like they have a calendar for us of activities we can do every day during the week. So we are going to go on the shopping trip. Um, we sign up at 11 a.m. And they leave at 12 p.m. So we're going to go um, and sign up for that um, and go on the shopping trip. I don't know what it consists of, but I'll bring you guys along with us. Um, but yeah. And then, because um, as I said yesterday, I think I said yesterday, I forgot my bathing suits. Packed everything under the sun but a freaking bathing suit. Like, what was wrong with me? See, this is why I don't pack at the last minute because this happens. I forget something. We packed the night before we left and 
I forgot my bathing suits. So we're going to try to go on a shopping ship. I can't even talk. We're going on a shopping trip. Hopefully we're going to be somewhere that has bathing suits and we can get souvenirs and all of that jazz. So I will catch you guys when we get ready to go sign up for the shopping trip and when we go on the shopping trip. So Five o'clock shots. That was really good. <laughs> That's probably the best shot I ever had. Really? Yeah, that was really, it was sweet. Probably the best shot I ever had, y'all. Cause that was good.
the park right now at the back of everyone sleep, sleep, sleep. I'll be waiting there with my trench, my lotion, my hat. And we are going to Koki Beach. We've heard so many good things about Koki Beach. So we're going to go check it out. We're waiting on a shuttle. It's a free shuttle from the resort that'll take you straight to Koki Beach. I think it's about a 20 minute walk, but why not take the free shuttle? So we're waiting. It's supposed to come at 10 a.m. It's currently 9.52. So we're gonna explore the Koki Beach and see what it's all about. I'm excited. How about you? I'm excited. I'm excited. In the room? Oh dang. Y'all. I forgot my beach bed. I forgot my bathing suit. Had to go get my bathing suit yesterday. We just been forgetting everything. I forgot my camera in the room yesterday, so I recorded footage from yesterday partly on my phone. So yeah, so we'll see what Koki Beach is hitting on y'all. So y'all stay tuned. Make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe. See y'all later. Restroom area, change room, shower area, right in this vicinity right here. Okay. We got bars and restaurants alongside the beach and bars and restaurants on the sand itself. Okay. So if you need any chairs, just let me know. The chairs are five. You can get two chairs and a large umbrella for just 25. Okay. Put it up to you and the chairs all day, okay? All right. Okay. All right. Any chairs for anybody? Never good. Thank you.
How was your experience, baby? Overall? Yeah. yeah. I had fun. I had a blast. I'm ready to go home. I thoroughly enjoyed myself. I would do it again ten times over. Okay. I come back. I did. Okay. Would you want to stay somewhere else, or are you good where you at? I would stay here. Well, you don't want. You don't want to experience another spot. I do want to experience another spot. I want to go and see Saint Martin, Saint John, Saint Croix. I would want to see all of them and see what the difference is between all. Of them. Is that four? Yeah. Four different beaches, Queen Island. Yeah. Yeah. I do it like I would like to explore the rest of the Virgin Islands. This is nice. Hey y'all, just checking in. It is much, much later. Um what time is it? 6.25. Um, this is our last full day in St. Thomas. Um after after um the beach. We was stop drain. We took a nap. Baby got something to eat. I had ate pizza as you saw on the beach. So I wasn't, you know, hungry. He really only ate like maybe one slice out of my little personal pan pizza. So he was still hungry. So he got him a burger and some fries. I went to sleep, of course. He went to sleep. I had to wake him up so we could go eat. But one thing, y'all know me. I'm going to take a nap. At least once out of the day on vacation. I... I got to get some sleep. You know what I'm saying? I got to get some sleep. I got to get my rest. I come on vacation to relax and get extra sleep. But um, now we are waiting on the reggae night. They pushed the time up because it was six to eight. So we're waiting on that to start. I don't know what was eating us alive outside, but we got the itching and carrying on. So we came in the inside for a little bit. I'm waiting for it to start. It starts in about 30 minutes. So I'll let y'all catch the reggae night. We overall have very much so enjoyed ourselves. Like this has been a really good trip, a really good honeymoon. I could not have picked a better person to spend the rest of my life with. This boo that's bay, this hubby. So we're gonna be relaxed and recharged to get back to work and put our foot back to the pavement. So, we needed this reset because 10 months of planning a wedding and only really taking one vacation the whole summer or the whole year. We only had one vacation besides this and this whole year and we usually be on the move. So, it's been good. Um, we were talking to some people that we rode a taxi with back from Kogi Beach, and they were saying that St. Croix is another good place to go. It's not as crowded as St. Thomas, a little bit more calmer. So that may be another destination in the near future. Who knows? Um, but we want to do something stateside next time. So we're trying to think of our next vacation. We don't know where that's going to be at yet, so... Y'all be on the watch for that. I got a lot, a lot, a lot of content coming if it hasn't come before this video. So, no, thank you. <laughs> I don't want to look at another drink. I don't margarita out. You hear me? Margarita out. I don't want to see another drink. Babe, he over it. <laughs> he over drinking. So, um, y'all try that bamboo. It's by Lil Wayne. It's a rum. I don't know if it's a Caribbean thing, but they are really big on the rum. So. But yeah, I wanted to catch up with y'all. Let y'all know what's going on. So yeah, St. Croix may be in the works for another beach vacation, but we think about doing something stateside next time. Maybe New York, Cali, Denver, New Orleans, Vegas, one of the two. I mean, one of the two. One of the few that I just named. Y'all, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Let me know what y'all think about this video. Um, and be on the lookout for some brand new, fresh content, y'all. So, y'all stay tuned.
Thank you.